Tonight, we have new information on the president's military service. Kate Blanchett and Robert Redford team up in Truth, a political drama set in the lead-up to the 2004 U.S. presidential election. It is based on the true story of longtime CBS news anchor Dan Rather and producer Mary Mapes, who chose to air a controversial news report that accused then-President George W. Bush of relying on his father's political advantages to avoid being drafted into the Vietnam War. Kate Blanchett has once again garnered unanimous critical praise for her performance in the movie, which recently premiered in Beverly Hills. Everything that happens in the film, there's nothing made up. Um, and I think the film is, is, a, is like a glass of water. It just it, it, it presents the events as they happened and then throws it back to the audience to say, well, how do you feel about corporate media ownership and, and its proximity to politics? And I think it transcends cultures. Yes, it's very particularly about Amer American politics and American media ownership, but that, those questions are relevant whether you live in Europe or Australasia or, or the States. I should have asked a question. You gotta make your case, honey. You have to fight. Truth marks the directorial debut of James Vanderbilt, better known as the writer and producer of films like Zodiac and The Amazing Spider-Man 1 and 2. While it differs from his earlier work, he says the film was a project close to his heart. What we are talking about is you bringing your politics into your report. I did nothing of the kind. Where does politics not enter into this? I love movies where you can kind of go behind the curtain and sort of see how things are done and, and how things are made. And so I love the idea of doing that with television news. And this seemed to be the perfect story to do that with because there were so many facets of what happened. And, and then being able to do it with somebody like Kate is in see it through her eyes, see it through Mary Mapes' eyes was really exciting to me. Vanderbilt has been commended for the keenly focused intelligence and low boil intensity of his directorial debut, which is out this month in the US and early next year in Europe.